day, every day. Hi moms, hi dads. Welcome back to my channel. Um, for those of you, if you're new, thank you so much for stopping by, get comfortable, and subscribe <laughs> if you're returning. Thank you for rocking with me, coming back to see another video. I appreciate you just as much as you appreciate me. And today I'm going to be doing a grocery haul. I hope you guys can see all of this. It took me forever to try to get all this stuff on this eensy beensy teensy weensy table. My couch is pretty, pretty huge. But the table, neck. So I'm going to be packing away as I show you guys the items that I've gotten. I'm going to start with the cooler items so we can go ahead and get those in the fridge. Now of course I have shredded hash browns. These are for the breakfast burritos that I make. <laughs> so yeah, I use these to make breakfast burritos. I'm going to just drop things around places. And then we have, and then we have seasoned potatoes, uh, french fries. We do uh, loaded french fries instead of loaded nachos. They're much more heartier and it's a great dinner. Bag of fruit for me and my daughter. We love to munch on these. I love to blend up green smoothies with these. Let's go on to the meat. We have five pounds of chicken breast, frozen. I use this in everything. We do toquitos, we do, um, uh, we do pot pies, we do breakfast burritos or lunch burritos, cheesy rice and bean, cheesy rice and chicken burritos, that's what they call it. Then I have two, yeah, I have two ground sausages for our breakfast burritos. And I have three, and I have three, and I have three ground turkeys. This Gross part is a lot harder than I thought. So yeah. I also have a three pound ground beef. Two chison chicken patties. One spicy, one's not. Adults and kids. A, these are breakfast sausages. Um, patties, we use them for the breakfast sandwiches we make. We have three bags of broccoli. I put this in my cheesy Alfredo. Broccoli, chicken, and cheese Alfredo. And then we have the frozen veggies, mixed veggies, for the Popeye. I have two Publix, not Publix, um, Great Value Flaky Biscuits for the breakfast sandwiches. And then I have these Jumbo Flaky Biscuits from Aldi's. These are more affordable, but they didn't have enough at all these, so I ended up getting substituting at Walmart. And then I have four packs of these crusts. I use them for chicken pie pie. I use them for, um, I call them hot dog swirls, but it's like, I don't even know how to explain it. It's a hot dog wrapped in this and cheese. And yeah, so that is all of the cooler items. We'll get started on the next items. Alrighty guys, so we cleared a little bit of space off the table. Let's continue. I have Gala apples. I got these from Sam's Club. Halos. I got these also from Sam's Club. And oranges. I like to get fruit that doesn't like expire super, super quick. Because I just, it's a waste of money. <laughs> Then I have these semi-sweet morsels. These I got from Aldi. They're only like a dollar and some change. Um, and we like to make cookies. I like to make dumpster cookies, which is pretty much you put anything that you have at the house. I would put coconut. Um, I would put like chopped walnuts. I'll put these in there. Um, I'll put marshmallows in there. It's just dumpster cookies. Sounds gross, but they're delish. Then there's 
so much cheese in this haul. We eat a lot of cheese. I'm trying to find other recipes that we may like without cheese, but we eat a lot of cheese right now. So this goes into a lot of recipes as an add-on. This is the Velveeta cheese sauce. Got that from Walmart. Um, chicken, cream of chicken and cream of mushroom. These two go in our pot pies with some, um, it goes in there with, what is it called? Chicken breast, um, chicken broth, chicken broth, oops. <laughs> I have three cans of large olives. I eat them out of the can. I don't know if that's weird. I feel like it's normal, but you guys can let me know down below. <laughs> A new can, a new bottle of almond milk. My daughter's allergic to regular milk. She's not allergic. She has an intolerance. She always gets an um, ear infection. So we just stick with almond milk. I have a jar of garlic because garlic goes with everything, in my opinion. <laughs> if if you don't like garlic, I'm sorry to hear that. But garlic goes with everything. It makes everything taste so good. Then I have Parmesan cheese. We don't really use this for like spaghetti or anything like that. I like to put it in the homemade hummus that I make. Delish. Salsa. I put this in eggs. Believe it or not. That's what this is for. It's for my eggs. I love it. Marshmallows. They're either a snack or we got actually a large box of um, cocoa. So that's what these are actually for. Raisins. I do ants on the log for snacks. Well, at least for the next couple days. I'll be doing ants on the log. So I needed raisins for her celery. Three cream cheeses. These go on our po' boy subs. I got the recipe from this lady off of YouTube. Her name is Amy Myron. She is so dope, and those subs are so good. Oh my goodness. She like does all kinds of freezer meals, um, large family grocery hauls, etc. etc. I think she has like a bajillion kids, and she's super mom. I love her. <laughs> then we have jelly for the peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I also got it off of Amy Myron's channel. She makes pre makes peanut butter jelly and stick it in them the freezer. I also do that with the cheese sandwiches for my daughter. Easy lunch. Then we have spinach. Three bags of spinach because again I like to make smoothies with them. It's an easy way to get your veggies all at once. For me specifically I have a really 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 bad sweet tooth. So the smoothies that I make are sweet enough for me not to go overboard with regular sweets because I will eat cake all day. Then we have oats. I make oat flour with this or I will mix this in with the um, instant oats to make my daughter's breakfast a little bit heartier without so much sugar. It balances, it balances out the sugar. So this is the best. Again, cheese, 160 slices of cheese, cheese sandwiches, um, breakfast burritos, breakfast sandwiches, cheese. <laughs> then we have butter, because this is like crack, country crack is what we call it. Um, it's country crack, guys. But yeah, we have butter. And then we have smoked honey turkey and smoked ham. This is for the po' boy sandwiches, or subs rather. Then we have three cans of ragu, um, garlic, roasted garlic parmesan alfredo sauce. Three cans of ragu. Double cheddar, and that goes in the um, shredded chicken 
broccoli and cheese alfredo pasta. It's so good. And quick and freezable and amazing. Only one egg because we still have three cartons of eggs in the fridge. Alrighty guys. I hope you guys can see. Alrighty guys. So moving on. We have sub bread. One, two, three, four. And then sandwich bread for the peanut butter jelly and the cheese sandwich. We also have the small little a tortilla, tortilla. We use them for the tiquitos. They're so good. I have the extreme wraps because they're only 50 calories and I like them. Then I have three burrito wraps. Because I'm making breakfast wraps, I'm also making lunch wraps. I have carrots because my daughter loves carrots with peanut butter. Bananas because it's self-explanatory. <laughs> they're delicious. Tons of celery for our ants on a log. More cheese. <laughs> More cheese, guys. Sorry. And two cases. Two cases of water. A, a 30 pack. A 30 pack um, chocolate cocoa. And, um. Tons of little snacks from Dollar Tree. We have pretzels. We have cheese doodles. We have veggie sticks. We have barbecue bugles. We have onions or uh, onions. We have the wise honey barbecue. We have potato skins. By Fridays, um, the cheddar and bacon. We have the popcorners, kettle corn. We have the popcorners, white cheddar. And we have the hot fries. Now, I got this also off of um, Amy Myron's channel. She makes them the calls like a trash bag snack where she puts all of that stuff in one rolls it up, and then she'll separate it for the kids to eat. Um, so yeah, that's what I have. That's my plan for that because it gives her variety where she doesn't get bored. Um, and also, it was all a dollar. Can't beat that. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. If you enjoyed this, please don't forget to give us a big thumbs up. And subscribe leave a comment down below let's talk hello I want to know what kind of content you guys like if you're watching this um thank you <laughs> yeah so that's pretty much it thank you so much for tuning into my channel I like me and my daughter like to say we're out